people in the city don't really know about the forest preserves. They're kind of a, a wonderful green emerald ring around the city. The forest preserves are owned by the taxpayers, and it's about 69,000 acres, 11% of our land. It's a wonderful, wonderful asset. You're out here, you can hear the wind in the trees, you can hear the birds. So it's very, very peaceful. This is one of the oldest forest preserve districts in the United States and the largest forest preserve district in the United States. Drive in and set up a, a picnic, unload your bike, go for a swim at uh, one of our aquatic centers or bring out your fishing pole. All of these things are accessible to everybody for free 365 days a year. Beyond just active recreation is the conservation side of the preserve and the aspect of land management. We're the last bastion in many cases for certain plants and animals that, that really are only found here in the forest preserves of Cook County. Zoonotic disease represents the fastest growing infectious disease in the world today. And about 75% of the new diseases are zoonotic, those that are transmitted from animals to humans. I see myself working with the forest preserves. It's just so great to see children excited about being outdoors and so that they can learn from a young age because the future of our earth is with the children. have this kind of open space so close to a major metropolis is really unheard of. The more people are connected and have an appreciation for it, the more people will want to protect it and even enhance it and even grow it. A lot of people have lost some of their uh, roots of being outdoors. This is something that's a treasure that we need to protect in the long term and that it is of value to them.